This is another one. This good reader. This good reader. The reason I like good reader uh, is because I can go in through there and I can make uh, different folders. I can name the different folders. Uh, whatever I want, it looks more like my Windows Explorer does on my desktop or my laptop. Whenever you open it up, you know, go to your internet in your Safari, uh, and you click anywhere on the screen, it's going to come up here, open in, and you can do open in iBooks or whatever, but open in Goodreader will come up, and when you open it in there, it's going to, it's going to stick it in there, and you know, the Rice Production Handbook is our MP192. You can click on there, and this rename will highlight, and then you can rename the publication. You know, a lot of stuff that I got, especially from other universities that aren't quite as good as the University of Arkansas. Of course, I am biased. But it had stuff on there, and the file name would be Q174299. You know, and I didn't know what in the world that was till I opened it up. But you can get in there and rename it. Also, you can bookmark stuff. Uh, in this iPad, you know, I have our MP44, or 144, or 154. I have the rice production handbook, the corn production handbook, you know, soybean production handbook. Everything's uh, in a PDF format with the exception of, like, the wheat production handbook. But, I mean, that's, you know, that's something that we're working on. Maybe we'll get out pretty soon. But I have a stack of books in this iPad. Uh, I'm telling you, I used to have to keep up in the truck and fumble around with and, and, and get through there uh, to get to a certain page. With this good reader, you can click this little button right over here and add a bookmark on whatever page you happen to be on. And then when you want to go back to it, this bookmark button down here, and I can hit rice, soybeans, cotton, corn, whatever I want to hit, hit the burn down button, and I'll go right to the ratings chart or whatever page I want to make it that I go to. You can also put the, uh, you know, the in the MP44, there's the section on there that's got herbicide prices. You know, you can put prices on there. And, and bookmark anything you want to want to do on on there. 